Hey guys, it's been a while since you last see me. So whenever you see me, you see free gifts. Today I'm going to give out like quite a number of free gifts. And before that, before that, you see any difference with this face of mine? Do I look better? <laughs> no. <laughs> okay, basically I just cut my hair. Okay, I just cut my hair. And I look a bit different. Okay, so... I look a bit different doesn't mean I do plastic surgery. Yeah. Don't ask me that question, please. Okay, so as you can see from the tagline above, above me, above me, that today I'm going to teach you something which is called slimming down. And this is the new theory in the whole world. It's called the Keith theory. <laughs> okay, okay. So basically, um, to start off with everything, I want to let you guys know to attract you to like uh, continue watching this whole video, right? It will be a very, very long one. I don't know why, for no reason. I've like been recording and recording and recording and recording and you know, this it will be the longest vlog, okay? I've lost a total of 15 kgs, 1, 5, 15 kgs. So quite a lot right quite a lot so you know I lost this much that's why I want to vlog about it okay okay so um, I'm going to tell you a little bit history of why I slim down so basically I was sick last year I was sick uh, I had fever for like three weeks and I lost 6 kg and after that I was thinking like I have really lost 6 kg so I should continue slimming down and here I am today okay so the in the Keith's theory it's not the best theory it's not the healthiest theory but it works okay it works and uh, although it's not healthy it's not healthy okay but I'm here today, I did not die or something, so how bad can it be, right? Okay, so um, it's not bad, uh, I think, to me. Uh, it works, and if you have been slimming for a, a long period of time, and it doesn't work because you seek for the healthy way, uh, then this is the last resort already. Oh. Yeah, because I, I was very, very fat, previously and I tried to slim down and slim down but it doesn't work at all and every time I tried to slim down right I gained more weight after that I don't know why for what freaking reason I grew fatter after trying the healthier way so you should try the Keith's theory right now okay so question people ask me uh what do I eat when during this period of time uh I eat a bit tragically, I eat vegetables, I eat soya sauce with white porridge, I eat uh, no meat at all, no meat, no fat, no oily food, no junk food, no everything, you know, I when I go to barbecue, I just drink plain water, I don't even drink soft drinks, you know, it's so tragic. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> I already said it's not the health healthiest way already, right? So basically, I did not restrain myself from eating. I eat whatever I want. I eat all the unhealthy food. I eat everything cheesy. Like I eat a lot of cheese, by the way. I love to eat cheese. I eat a lot of meat, and you know the mixed vegetables rice, right? I eat with all like three three servings of meat in it. Every day I eat like this. If you know me and you and you read my blog or my or my Twitter, okay, you can see that every time I blog about food, I blog about uh I know I know I'm I tweet about food which are very oily and I eat them and I'm like very very happy and I eat a lot. The good thing about this is I eat a lot and I still can slim down. Okay? Yeah, so basically you just need to uh, cut down the uh, serving but you increase the portion of your food so I used to eat three meals a day 
when last year I I eat three meals a day and because I was sick then I eat very little and I started to eat lesser and lesser like become one meal a day and because of that one meal a day I slim down a lot but that one meal I eat a lot like, I can eat like uh mixed vegetable rice with three three servings of food and one more something like it's more like two servings in one portion it's like one big junk portion but after that portion you don't eat anything else already yeah so with this method right you can eat almost anything you can eat all the fast food that you like i'm not going to mention the fast food names but there's one typical fast food restaurant that i don't eat and i think it's very 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 unhealthy it's Okay, you know, okay, it's that freaking thing, that one with the red boots uh, mascot, okay? So, I don't eat that. I think that it's very, very unhealthy. and But I still eat it. I, I ate that today, but I don't eat as frequent as the other, other, other uh, fast food, lah, okay? So... Don't eat that. I think don't eat that. But I don't discourage you not to eat that. I also eat that. Okay, when when there is nothing else to eat. <laughs> okay. So another thing that I want to let you know is that do not snack. Do not snack when you want to be on diet. I know a lot of people, right? They snack a lot and they skip the that freaking one important meal portion a day. But don't snack if you eat the main portion already. Do not snack at all. Do not eat chocolates or do not eat tidbits. Do not. If you want to eat chocolates and tidbits, right, then you just freaking eat uh, chocolates and tidbits the whole day. Then you don't eat the main portion. Yeah, you must give and take. But if you want to have both, right, you can. You can, but you do not do it every time. Maybe like once a week or, or what lah. But you do not go and calculate, right? So every time I eat that one portion and I eat with that freaking bits when I, I snack, I will do some something to um, compensate compensate the loss. So it's like it's like I do exercises. Okay, by the way, I do not do exercises like daily at that point of time. But now I do exercises daily already. Okay, but because some of you are like very lazy like me, I'm damn lazy. But because I've lost weight and I want to be slimmer and I want to keep maintain that level of slimness okay I'm not very slim also uh, I, I'm like I want to maintain it so I do exercises so I do a few exercises a day I do 50 to 100 push-ups a day but nowadays I'm like damn lazy la. I do 50 only <laughs> okay I'm like very lazy but at least I do okay and I do sit-ups I do 100 sit-ups uh, a day and <clears throat> you must do sit-ups. You die die must do sit-ups. Because if you don't do sit-ups, like, you feel that your tummy is very fat and you need to do it to slim down. And it works. It really, really works. And I do a 100 to 150 curls. You know the thing that you do, the, this thing, yeah, I do that also. Because if you don't do all this right, the method that I'm teaching you right now is it's not about exercising. So, uh... So you get to lose weight, but your 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 loose fats will be very loose. So it's more like it tightens your fats uh, and stuff like that lah. Uh, okay, and or else you will still feel that you are like very meaty and stuff like that. Okay, and it's very gross. I don't know why. For goodness sake, it's very gross. Okay, so the next part is how to slim down the face, the face part, which is what you cannot find mo in most. Uh, diet videos okay so this is the special point uh, my sell unique selling point for this vlog entry it's i'm going to teach you how to slim down the face part okay it works 100 percent works because it was taught by a yoga teacher that i had when i was 16 so i've just reviewed something that i'm older than 16 so, okay so it's true, 100% true, and you can see the difference between my jawline now and the difference in the past one year, okay? I did not have any surgery to my jaw or my face, okay? So...